Many of us lament the fact that the superheroes we love can't be found in real life. But can a fictional superhero, a vigilante confined to the pages of a comic book or screen, still save someone or inspire them to reach for greatness in their lives? More people than you'd think are inclined to say yes. Our first award recipient this evening is among them. He knew that the Black Panther movie was especially important for black youth, and that is why he began the Black Panther Challenge by crowdfunding to enable underprivileged young students in Harlem to attend the hit blockbuster, ensuring his very crucial belief that black children need to see themselves as heroes too. He followed this effort, calling for and inspiring hundreds of Black Panther challenges across the nation, raising several hundred thousand dollars, bringing the film to countless young viewers who could have not seen it otherwise. Even if a hero can't patrol our streets or stop our bad guys, he can still work wonders by imagining all children to do good and achieve their full potential. Frederick Joseph understands that well, and we're very proud to give the Bob Clampett Humanitarian Award to him. inclusivity, and opportunity. You get magic, but more important than magic, you get understanding and perspective. As people vehemently work right now to make sure all of us feel separated from one another, people who are in the White House, it's important that we continue to try to understand one another and have perspective about where all of us come from. The understanding that heroes come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. The perspective that a movie can change lives and help us celebrate a world of culture. These are the values that my mother and grandmother instilled in me, which I poured into the Black Panther Challenge. Before I continue, my mom is actually here, so I just wanted to say thank you. They taught me that we all deserve to be respected, supported, and feel seen. So I aimed to create something that paid homage to those beliefs. And thanks to the people around me and all of you, we made something special happen. People from 20 different countries donated, every single state in America, young people held car washes, and people donated their last dollar, all bringing us to close to a million dollars raised and we took 75,000 kids around this world to see the Black Panther for free. And that's exactly why this award isn't just mine. This award belongs to literally every single person who donated, everyone who shared, my mother and my late grandmother, because I wouldn't be here without them. But our work isn't done. And I don't want anyone to be mistaken about that. Um, the Black Panther was an amazing moment, and there's going to be more amazing moments. But what we need is movements. So um, I just want to tell you guys about something and kind of do a really cool Comic-Con announcement. So first of all, um, what I did after the Black Panther was create an agency called We Have Stories. And we're creative marketing.
Okay, let's do our second award now. Anyone who's taken